What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's Dan here. I'd like to welcome you guys back to my Let's Play of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic Female Grey Jedi Edition. Hope you guys are enjoying this Let's Play so far, and if you are, be sure to hit that like button. It helps out a lot. Without any further ado, let's get into the video. All right, fam. Let's do this. Work our way across. I think this is... I don't know if this is the central. Where are we now? That's the hotel. Public Enclave. So that's actually where we gotta go. Okay, so that nothing over there. Don't worry. I'm just gonna head into this shop. I don't think there's much in here, but I'll check. See if there's anything worth it. How much for all this stuff, Tybark? Gee, we, I, uh, this set the month's pay, but since you remember member of the Republic, I'll charge you a week's salary. Thanks, Tybark. Catch you next week. See, the Republic are actually friendly. Come in, come in. You honor my humble store with your presence. All Manana's heard stories of your glorious swoop riding exploits. I carry many other choice items of the highest quality. Items a celebrity of your stature might be interested in. See what you got. As you wish. See if there's anything worth it. Military, bro, bro, I've already got these back on Terrace. Anything worth buying from him? I don't think so. The holdout blaster, it's small enough that when you get pulled, they don't see it. I have a lot of money though, but it's nothing I really want, you know? Strength gauntlets, I already got one of those. Beam and package? Nah, thanks though, man. All right, at least I stopped in and checked it out. All right, guys, we're going to the Republic Enclave, and we're going to do a couple things before we drop right down into Submersible. Um, we are going to... We're going to torture Homeboy, and I got to find out... Well, I do end up finding out the Republic... I'll talk to him, I'll talk to him in a second. Here's the guy here. Let's just mess with him. Let's save. Fresh save. Eight. What is it? 18, 20... Nope, 18... 50? 40. Good. Seems like ages ago we were on the Sith base. Slice it. Done. Easy. Sorry. That's what I want. I want a bit of dark side. I want a bit of dark side in my life. See, now we're neutral again. See, we've always been on the upper side of it. Have you managed to retrieve the data from our... Yep. Excellent. It does not appear to have been tampered with, so the Sith did not manage to copy its contents yet. And now for your information. We are not supposed to speak of this, but since you are a Jedi and we have exhausted all the other options, I think I can entrust you with this. As you know, the Republic is fighting for its very existence against the evil of the Sith Empire. As you also undoubtedly know, we're doing very poorly. We need much in the way of supplies and material to stem the tide of battle and bring us victory. Manan is the sole source of Kulto, the most powerful medical substance in the galaxy. Frankly, we need as much of it as we can get. Yeah, you get to the point. The Selkath conservatives, with their neutrality treaties, seek to treat the Sith and the Republic equally. This includes Kulto exports, but a few more far-sighted Selkath see that if the Sith are ever allowed to win, the galaxy will be plunged into darkness, and there would be nothing to stop them from taking Manon anyway. So we made a deal. Um, you violated the treaty. Shh, not so loud. Yes, it is a technical violation of the treaty, but it is sanctioned by elements of the Selkath government. We need only to keep it hidden from the Sith. We recently began construction of a secret underground facility to harvest Kulto directly at its source. We also hope to one day be able to synthesize it effectively. Current techniques are insufficient for the task, so we must mine it for now. The amount we take would hardly be noticed, since most is lost naturally before it reaches the surface anyway. We were nearing completion of the base when the digging teams reported some sort of obstruction, um, an ancient building or artifact, possibly your star map. Transmissions from the base were cut off abruptly after that, and we haven't heard from the station since. What happened down there? We don't know. We just don't know. As you may have noticed, we're hiring a lot of mercenaries around here. Ostensibly, they're to be shipped off-world to aid in our fight against the Sith, but they're really for another purpose. When we lost contact with the station in the Brackard Rift, we sent our contingent of Republic soldiers down to investigate. None returned. We've tried hiring mercenaries and sending them down as well, but none of those expeditions have returned either. The reason we really sent that droid underwater, and the reason we needed its data back so badly, was to find out what happened to the Rackard Rift Station. But now that we have the data back, our operation is in no danger of exposure to the Sith. And now I must live up to my end of the bargain. What will you do for me? I took the liberty of having a submarine prepared for your departure. Merely use this card to get past the door behind our Colto packing room and enter the sub therein. It has been programmed to take you down to the station. 
and also to take you back up should you need something. I would send soldiers to assist you, but we've lost many of ours and nearly exhausted the mercenary population of this planet. The soldiers we have are barely enough to keep this base secure. The Sith have also noted our interest and begun to bribe mercenaries away from us. Please, find out what happened to the facility. There may be some survivors left down there. Perhaps even the head scientist, Kono Nolan. Good luck in your efforts. Cheers. All right, we're going down, guys. It's been a long time. Oh, what's happened? What? No, stop. Sorry, I'm hitting the wrong buttons. It's been a long time coming. Yes. Damn it, Harley. Yes? She hit tab, which changed. Harley, move your feet. She always got to lean. Like, have you noticed cats have to touch stuff? Like, for example, say you have a piece of paper on a table. They won't lay down on the table. They'll lay down on the paper. I don't know. It's weird about them. But it's funny. Did you come with another submersible? Quick, we gotta go! Fish for Sorry. That's my, uh, that's, that's my, uh, chicken turkey. My turkey thing. Anyway. You think those things have sent another submersible? Let's bounce. This, this part of this mission, this part of Manon is actually really fun. I hashtag like it. Here we go. So what is is this record rift? Not yet, right? What are we on? This is the record station. Okay, we are on the station. You are my antidote. Okay, there's a lot of stuff down here. And eventually we'll have to step outside. But we'll make it work. I, like I said, I really there's the damage submersible. It got absolutely wrecked. Ours is fine. All right, let's see. Now this, this, the thing is, I might encounter a lot of stuff from cut content down here. How, how did you get in? Did they send another submersible? Quick, we have to get out of here. We have to get away. Who are you? No, no, we have no time. We have to leave now. I managed to close the door after they killed everyone else, but I don't know how long it will hold. What happened? The cell calf, they went crazy. They started killing anything that moved. Someone must have triggered the defense systems too, because all the droids activated as well. I was one of the mercs the Republic sent down here to find out what happened. We came down and secured the first couple of rooms. There were bodies everywhere, and the cell calf came out screaming and croaking their fishy little war cries. What happened to the scientists? They're dead. All dead. They swarmed out and over us. There was no way we could stop them, so we ran. But hardly any of us made it. I locked the door behind us, but, but the others had already left in the submersible. The sharks, the Feroxa out there, and worse. I heard an explosion shortly after the submersible left. They didn't make it. Just food for the sharks and the Silcath, like us. I didn't see anything. That doesn't mean it's not still out there, watching, waiting. I have to get into the station. No! I locked the door so the cell calf won't get in. If you open it, we're all done for. Tough. I need it open. If you go in there, you're dead. You're all dead. If you want to die, then go. You won't hear me mourning for you. I'll stay here and be safe until some sort of real rescue comes. He's such a salty punk. Anyway, let's get... I think in one of these things, there eventually there's going to be a... Um, uh, like a... Like a Deep sea dive. Did I already grab this one? So I can't remember if that was the same one. Yeah, it is. Okay. Cool. Let's go. These guys are really not that hard to beat. Lord Malak was most displeased when he learned you had escaped Thalys alive. He promised a great reward. They always roll their R's. You notice that? For whoever destroys you. I don't think I can access this. Oh, yeah, I can. Slice, storage room. Bye bye Skip out on these guys. <laughs> there you go. That's one. 
West storage room. They're all amped up. Let's vent it. I love it because one spike. I don't only have a few spikes left, but this will save me so much time. God, that savage dressing. <laughs> All right, east hallway. Nah, it's not worth it. Uh, south hallway. Not worth it. Uh, security room. It's three spikes, not worth it. Environment suit containment. This is the guy that's it. I wonder if we can actually get him out this time. Security. That's us. All right, goodbye. We're done. We just got a ton of experience for doing that. Anyway, I can't remember. Actually, I don't think I can go through this door. Nope. All right, let's go. So we're going to thoroughly search this entire station before we... Uh... I'm not really worried. That shuts them down. And quite frankly, it's just a... Uh... It's just the it's just a formality at that point. Let's save again. Yeah, I definitely love this part of Manon. Because Manon is super cool. Oh, I thought we got this guy. All they're doing is killing me. Or hitting me. Only totally killing us, not a big deal. Alright, let's get a uh, big force wave, knock them on their booties. Woo! I got this one. Yes! Done. There's all you also gotta get one of those uh thingamajobbers. I'll get that droid later, don't worry. I don't think I can go out this way. Oh wait, I can go out this way. Go hit him once. It was more critical the last time. I got slowed down for a minute. That's it. Okay. Don't worry, guys. I will do a thorough search. This is a room. I think it's where that droid is. Don't hit it. They're going to hit it. Watch. Yep. Good job, morons. I think this actually has uh, uh, that that thing we need. Yeah, the sonic emitter. That's very important. Use that against the uh, Phy Phyraxa sharks. Which room is it? Is Eventually, we get to a room with the guy hiding in the locker. He's saved. I don't know if this will work very well. I'm hurt. There you go, it's down, destroy him. It does work. See, yeah, see, it doesn't shut him. Now we can't do anything about it. Done. See, that was honestly, it wasn't worth wait a little. Wasn't worth wasting the spike on that. This is where that dude is, isn't it? Need your suit. On it. Done. Parts. This guy's in it, I think. Or is that? Yeah, one of them's Done. called the like whimpering lockers. Done. Is this the whimpering locker? No, the other one is. Did I get this guy? On it. Done. All right, let's talk to the whimpering locker. Is somebody out there? Fishy, fishy, fishy. <laughs> Come and eat me too. <laughs> you can't get me, little fishy. Nothing here. I'm safe behind my walls. Won't you come out here? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, just like the others. Order for the Selkath. Walk and fish snacks. Trump, trump, trump. If you can run, you might be fast food. The Selkath went insane and started killing everybody. I locked myself in here. I'm safe in here. Nothing can hurt me in here. No fishy food for me. I don't think you could do. I don't think you can get him out. What we'll made the cell cap insane? Don't know. Go ask them. <laughs> when the demon screamed, it shook every mind in the station. We fell to the ground but survived. Fishy fishies, though, they just got hungry. You want to come out? No, no. Only 
the ones left in the south part of the base might still be alive, but where the Colter is, few fishies there, but many, many, many fishies in between the water. I want to come out of that room. No, only th All right. Bye-bye. Go look for fishy people. They'll chomp and bite and chomp and bite. Food for fishy. That's you. You can't get them out of there. I thought that maybe we'd be able to, but... See, I don't want to go this way just yet. Oh, this is where we took out a bunch of guys. See, this is where we have the advantage. So what we're going to do now, guys, is we're going to get these remains, obviously. And this is where it wants us to go that way. So we're actually going to... I think this one has the uh, the suit in it. Oh, another one of those. Never mind. But we might be able to sell it. Right, we're going to go this way, and we're going to go back. So we're going to take a... Yeah, down the hallway. It's too easy, man. Not this again! Yeah, see, this is the other end of the hallway, so... Another one down there. So what we're going to do is actually go down this way. We can probably leave each one of these. We don't have a suit. Oh, we do have the suit. I forgot. So we can leave here, but we're not going to. Not going to. We're full of thoroughly cleansing. Because it makes more sense to walk the length of this place. And deal with everything we can. Done. I think this was the other room that we got rid of all the Salkath from. Nice and simple. Good. I thought there was Sel... Maybe there was Salkath in here, but they just happened to survive or something. Anyway... Don't worry about that. I don't worry about these deadly mods. I haven't been working on my... Ex Whoa, it sucked me... Wow. Good job, dude. And now he's dizzy. Go! Hit them, you guys! Too many guys at once. Too many homeboys. Bye-bye. Go like for fetching, PayPal. Now, I don't really remember if I installed a mod. Which, um... Sorry. Nice teamwork. That's very teamwork. This is gonna... Oh, wait. Smash. Let me... Alright, well, I guess we ain't doing it. I thought we got these cell cat. First we're gonna knock them all down. Then you pull your ass. For the order. Oh, that's awesome, dude. And then push them all away. I had no idea that's what that did. Get him. It's so dirty, I love it. Sorry about that. Plasma grenade. Good. Oh, they they all had something. It's just gonna be like something like a grenade, but nothing 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 too sharp. Okay, cool. So we again we can go through either one of these. I'm gonna save it. 1857. Okay, so we're gonna follow that all the way down. Again, you could leave at any point during this time if you wanna go check, but there's no point in it. There's no point, you might as well skip all the way to the end, far, far side, if you wanna get all the stuff possible. I've always found it's better to do it this way, unless this is a dead end. It actually might be a dead end. Oh, it is, so you just gotta pick an area. All right, well then what we're gonna do, okay, I know I just said I'm not gonna do this, but what we're going to do is the further down you go, like right here, if I leave this door, I think I don't have to walk that far. But maybe I want to walk that far. You know what? No, I don't. I'm just going to go this way. I thought that was it. Maybe not. But maybe this is... We'll just see. We'll just go through this. Let's go. Now, here's my thing. Did I install a mod that makes people walk fast? And No, I didn't. Great. Yay! 
Oh, this was like the biggest pain in the butt. I see where we are. Honestly, I don't think it would have made that much difference. Move. Move, please. God damn. I can't get through. I can't get through. Yes. Get out of the way. Good freaking god. Anyway, let me just open the map. The seafloor. Seafloor. They were roommates. Right, so this the other place we would have come out of was over here. On this side. Who's there? You're not Cellcast, I can see that much. Are you another rescue crew? What's going on down here? Isn't it obvious? The Cellcast have gone insane! They're killing everything that moves! All my companions are dead. The cell caps swarmed over us. There were dozens of them. And they they looked wrong somehow. Like something had changed inside them. Insane or something. They looked wrong. <laughs> this whole place smells wrong. Like an Aurelian Ergoth egg gone bad in the hamper. Oh, I'd have gone back to the surface long ago if this complex hadn't been overrun by all those crazy cell caps. There's no way for me to get to the submarine docking bay. What are you doing in the underwater section? I discovered a way to get to the bay and seal off the rest of the base. I just have to find the Colto Harvester they built on the edge of the Hrackert Rift. It's got an emergency override to open the doors to the submarine docking bay. And I could get in from the outside. I figured my only chance was to slap on an environment suit, head out onto the ocean floor, and check that harvester out for myself. Besides, it's gotta be safer out on the ocean floor than back in there with all those crazed cell calf mutants running around looking for dinner. All right. I'm not spending another minute in this facility. Not with those psychotic fish people all over the place. I'm heading out to the ocean floor right now. It leads to another complex of buildings. Going through them is the only way to reach the Colto Harvester. We should probably stick together. But I won't wait around in here with the cell calf. You can catch up with me if you want. Down the hall and through the doors on the right. I'll be waiting on the ocean floor where it's safe. Alright, bye boy! Okay, before we go there... I'm just gonna... I know... I, I'm actually gonna save. For reasons... That are my own. Um... What did I... What's my latest save? 1947. Back in my day! That way, okay, so he's gone that way. I'm actually going to walk the, the length of this. And the reason I'm doing that is just to see if there's anything I could check out on. And if not, if there's nothing worth it, well, maybe I'll just walk back. I don't know. But, if like, I think these are just other ways to get over. You know what I'm saying? So this is the way back into the station. That's the middle one. And the one over here is the far one. So I think that was what I was supposed to do if I wanted to thoroughly check. Because, therefore, there's the least amount of wall. So you could go through that door. What I'm saying is you could have gone through that first door... And skip out on all this. Can't remember if there's something over here, though. It's welded. I'll check. Damn. See, you wish you, they have it on... The thing that bothers me is they have it on the map, right? See how it goes down? You'd think... That it would... They'd maybe consider putting it in the game. That's the other one, right? No, that's the other one. Oh, there is a foot locker. That's right. Okay, it made it worth it. Made it worth it, you guys. It just did. Please be something decent. Wow. Oh, they're going to box me in. Watch. Ooh. Haters trying to box me in. They're trying to box me in. Nothing in there. Okay, let's go. Dude's lucky. Dude's a lucky man. I just hated how slow these were. In KOTOR 2, they in they sped it up so that you could walk faster, but literally you can't do anything at this rate. This is as fast as she goes. Hi-ho. Hi-ho. It's off to work we go. Skibbity bop beep 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 I discovered a way to get into the bay. 
Because, yeah, there was only two, right? There's only two spawn points. They, they're both basically the same. Sea floor, sea floor. I'm going in the door. Gabba da bop, 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 shoo da bop, bop, beep, beep, beep. I'm just going over here. Come on! And it's funny because as soon as you walk out to this dude, his voice changes. It's really rando. Okay, I'm gonna save again on the, la the latest save, 1951. Good. There's the sharks. Come on! Hurry up! I know we're on the way! Well, that escalated quickly. So here's the thing. Obviously, we can go this way. It's pointless. There's nothing over there. So we got to go this way. Now these guys, those, those fracks over there, don't really make a difference. Oh, whoops. You got to wait till you're nice and close. Okay, I get it. And hit it. It's a lifesaver. I remember there's a couple doors, but I'm not 100% sure if it is or not. That was actually close. That guy was getting near. But yeah, like I said, I remember there's a couple of doors. I don't know if... I think there's one on this side, like behind this tube over there, and then one over here, but I don't really remember. Or it's just one over here, and then that's the one we need to go to. Eventually, that's where we gotta go. <coughs> I might check out what's in here. Because I'm playing on PC, the loading screens are, are quick, right? So, it might be worth it this time. Oh, he's coming. See, that one seems a lot closer. So what I'm actually going to do is save over here. And then I actually want to run this way because it's a bit further. Keep an eye out for this Firaxa over here. <laughs> I don't think it makes a difference, but... I always forget. I think they're both connected in the end. Like this big area, you can walk between them anyway. It's just pick a pick a route and go in it. That's what I've found anyway. So, this is actually a different part of the Harakard Station, but it's still a part of it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, do me a favor, hit that like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you haven't yet, be sure to like and follow my pages on social media. Facebook.com slash DanQ8000 for live streams and other content. Twitter, DanQ8000. Instagram, DanQ8K. And Snapchat, DanQ8000. If you want to get yourself a shirt or hoodie, there's a link to my shop in the description below. And if you want to save 10% off your next DX Racer, link in the description. Be sure to use the promo code DanQ8000 at checkout. All right, guys, thank you so much again. Take it easy. Have a wonderful day. I'll be seeing you soon for more content. But until then... Let's hand things over to Knoxville. Have a good one, guys.